Hello YouTube, Misha Crossing here with my first 3DS video. I am so excited to start making these videos. For my first video, as you can tell, I'm going to be doing a town tour of Fawn, one of my towns, and I thought that would be a good first video. It's something kind of simple that won't require a lot of editing or planning on my part just to get I guess just to get both of our feet wet uh, with this whole gaming YouTube channel thing. So let's get the address put in for Fawn. I'm dreaming of Fawn in my town Honeyfur because obviously you can't dream of your own dream town so I had to use one of my other towns which is very undeveloped right now. Nothing exciting. Don't don't worry, you don't want to see it just yet. <laughs> now, Fawn is... It's my second town that I made, but I think it's my favorite. The theme of it is basically a fairy forest town. So I want it to feel very light and airy, but overgrown. And all of the human characters, you know, that I made to live there, I made into a certain type of fairy. And all of the animal villagers are deer villagers. Except for Julian, the unicorn, because why wouldn't you have a unicorn in a magic fairy town? So here we are in Fawn at the town center. Very clearly, I hacked my copy of Animal Crossing New Leaf to make Fawn because I've put items where they normally can't go. Flowers, bushes, trees are all over the place, even the river and beaches. So up here we have the bear costume laid out for us to wear along with the megaphone. But over here's the outfit I'm going to wear. We have a crown. What is this called? The silk bloom dress. The leaf umbrella. And the cucumber pack. Look how adorable we are. Okay, so how am I going to do this? Let's start by going up and over here. We're going to go through the Zen Garden, which starts with the actual Zen Garden Public Works project. And down here, Zen Streetlight, Modern Bench, Zen Clock, and the ever wonderful Zen Bell. And we come back at the bottom of the plaza. And that was just a very exhausting walk through the Zen Garden, so we should take a little rest in the outdoor chair, enjoy an apple. Got bamboo and trees in the rivers, like I said. Over here is the well, the wishing well. Lots of things in the little pond with the waterfall. What's this? Aw, oh, heart hairpin, cute. Down here is the diving area. There is a striped wetsuit. And a pink wetsuit, and of course, to match my hair, gotta go with the pink. Let's get back here, get a little running start for our dive. And we'll come over and look at the beach. Got some special stumps down here. And I love having the cherry blossoms on the beach and the bushes. Just makes it so much more fun to make your beach. Some more stumps and our first little gift here. 
Let's see what it is. Ah, throwing beans. A great first gift. Come on over here. Come to a bench. Blue pumps. I like my barefoot look, so I'll leave the shoes. Leave the shoes be. There's the ramp up, but we're going to explore the rest of the beach. I have grass on my ramps because I used a leaf tools hack to make grass grow all over the place, even on the ramps in the dirt patches. Take a little snooze on the beach in our little camping cot. On up here is just pretty much more forest. And a straw boater. I love the straw boater. And the lonely island <laughs> up there is, uh, there's not really anything of interest on it, to be quite honest. So we'll come down here and go up this ramp. go down there eventually. Not quite just yet. Got Fuchsia's house right here. Little stool with some mushrooms around it. On up here we will come to our first house, which is the mayor, Misha's house. Haha. <laughs> I love these statue fountains down here out in front. Looks like my character... Oop. There's the dream man with all the designs. I must be inside, so let us go inside. Here is the main room. I'll change out of my wetsuit now. There we go. Here's the main room. Got some little donuts over here to enjoy. <laughs> Sloppy couch. Super cute. And a little video game corner back here. There are nothing in those rooms that are blocked off. That's why they're blocked off. On the left. What could this possibly be? The kitchen. I love making kitchens. Got some food down here at the dining table to enjoy. Some sushi and grapes and pie and ice cream. The dessert case over here. And of course the kitchen island. I wish you could set stuff on the kitchen island. They solved that in Happy Home Designer. They listened to our complaints, but I still wish I could set things on the kitchen island. And the last room is upstairs, which is the bedroom. Just where, I assume... My character is? No? Okay, well, we'll find her later. Whatever. But here's the bedroom. The giraffe ruler over there. So cute. Pretend like nothing was seen. Da, 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 da. And a little kitty sleeping by the bed, like my actual cat would be doing. Maybe I'm just blind and missed my character outside. Oh, yes, there I am. <laughs> All the way back there. 
Come here. Come here, friend. You right there? Nope. That's a tree. There you are. Oh, MishaCrossing.tumblr.com. But she is the queen fairy, is what I made her, essentially. So we'll come on back down here. The police station. Down below the police station we have Stonehenge. In the fairy tale town hall. With the fountain below it. Little picnic blanket beside the town hall. And here is Fauna's house with Zell wandering around it. What could that mean? This is how rumors get started. Okay. And. Oh, which direction to go? Let's go down here. Oh, a gift. Oh, what even was it? I didn't even check. What's wrong with me? Oh, a pink balloon. Okay. And some houses. We have Julian's house, Zell's house, and Eric's house. All in a nice little row. With some sleeping kitties and the fairy tale clock. Oh, there's Eric. Eric, come here. He's adorable. Eric, where'd you, where'd you go? There he is. Uh, thank you, Eric. Let's go over here really quick. Got Lopez's house and Bruce's house. Very blue. Oh, and down here is a lighthouse. And the hammock. Looks so relaxing right there. On down here is the campsite. The little river going around it. So we'll head back up here. Here's another gift. What could it be? Oh, an indigo balloon. We're really shaking things up here. So here, the path has turned into little sweets tiles with a lollipop and some gorgeous little ants. So very clearly a sweets-themed house. And inside, it is also sweets themed, a little cafe of sorts. Oops. Some donuts while I'm here. Just play with all the things, of course. Alright. Oh, and there is the owner of the house back there. Why are they all hiding? Lolly. She's the sweets fairy. There's a gift up here. By the river. A toy hammer. Toy hammer and the throwing beans are two favorites. I've already been over there, so let's go on up here. We're not going to go across. Sorry about the pause. My screensaver came up and I didn't know if it stopped recording or not. Okay. And the water pump.
Come back around Fuchsia's house, up this path, across this bridge, and we come to the cafe. And a gift here. I wonder whatever it could be. Coffee. Of course. Makes sense. Hmm. Oh, here's another gift. Pink pinwheel. Very cute. I say cute to a lot of things. Tell me about it. We'll go ahead and come up here to the train station. I love having the trees right here. This area feels so dull without anything. This is a pink balloon! Another one! I'm just very generous with a lot of different things. It's a little tulip garden. And here's this head statue from Easter Island. I can't remember what the name is. I like the look of the public works projects and trees and stuff in the river. It makes it look like there used to be land there and now it's overrun with water. So very overgrown and magical, I think. And here's another house. Is the owner of this house hiding? Nope, she must be inside. Or not. She's they're just all very good at hiding. But this is this is the baby fairy's house, clearly. And I love it. I think it's my favorite of all of my houses. Of KK Lullaby Plane. I love this little egg set. Very precious. There she is. Just appeared out of nowhere. She's the baby fairy, Bambi. Now we will come back down here to the park. The tire toy. Picnic blanket and the jungle gym. I love the jungle gym. But this is going to be a repeat gift too, knowing me. It's a balloon. Okay, it's a heart balloon. I'll take that. Where are we gonna go? Let's go back up around to that character's house up there. But she's walking around outside somewhere here that I'm not going to see for some reason. <laughs> She is. She's inside. She's the garden fairy. As is very apparent by her house. So many trees and flowers and mushrooms. Love the rose chairs. Over here is Diana's house. Love her house. Oh, and the geyser's going off. Love the geyser. Retail here. Ooh, a gift. What could it be? Another toy hammer! Dear lord! 
I just really wanted you all, you know, dream visitors, to have a toy hammer. On down there is the town plaza again. But let's go see the pond. Buy retail. Have a sit. Oh, that's very serene. I wish I could be sitting there right now. <laughs> then on over here, this is above the Zen Garden. Bo's house. And then Deirdre's house. By the park. I believe that is all of Fawn. I have showed you everything. Well, I hope you all enjoyed my first 3DS YouTube video. Please let me know if you have any sort of video suggestions for things you would want to see. I'm definitely going to be doing some Dreamtown tours of other people's towns. Um, a happy home designer playthrough video. I'm going to start it over and play through it. I'm going to do playthroughs of Fantasy Life. I'll do... Oh, and for happy home designer, I will visit some other people's project designs and do little tours of them. And I also have... I have, like, Nintendogs and Animal Crossing Wild World for the regular DS, so I might do some sort of nostalgia video with those. But for now, I will leave you with this nice, serene image of fun. I hope you all have a wonderful day, be kind to one another, and don't forget to be awesome. Bye!